We begin tonight with breaking news out of Sherman Heights, where one person was injured after getting hit by an ice cream truck. Good evening. Thanks for joining us. I'm Marcella Lee. I'm Carlo Chiquetto. The truck also crashed into an electrical circuit box and a gate outside of San Diego Police Department's Central Station. News 8's Amanda Shotsky is live on the scene with the latest on the investigation. Amanda? Well, you can see this is still a very active scene behind me. The ice cream truck is still resting on that power box right next to where the police station is. There's a lot of utility vehicles here, and there seems to be a lot of conflicting information, whether the person who was injured was a pedestrian or a passenger inside that ice cream truck. But we do know that one person is in the hospital tonight. People in Logan Heights say they heard the collision even before they saw it. I heard this here scream and I heard this here squeaking tires. It was 6.30 Tuesday night when, according to witnesses, an ice cream truck came speeding down 25th Street. The driver claims his brakes stopped working. You catch pretty good speed. It's like if you don't have brakes. Police say the truck turned on Imperial Avenue, speeding through a gas station parking lot, injuring a person before slamming into a police station gate and then a transformer box, cutting power to surrounding businesses. Units arrived on scene. Uh, they noticed that the ice cream truck behind me had collided into the transformer box. The injured person was taken to the hospital and the ice cream truck driver stayed at the scene. Police say DUI does not appear to be a factor in this crash, but exactly what happened remains under investigation. San Diego Police Department Traffic Division is handling and they're going to get to the bottom of this. And the condition of the person who was injured is unknown at this point. We know they're undergoing evaluation in the hospital. As you can see behind us, though, there's a lot of activity. There's a tow truck on the scene that's coming to finally remove the ice cream truck, which has been resting here for quite a few hours. Also on scene, STG&E trucks that have just arrived here because, as we mentioned, the power has been shut off because the truck hit a utility box resting up against the San Diego police station. Now, it is still unclear, though, exactly when the power will be turned back on. Back to you. Thanks, Amanda.